Birds of many feathers flocking together at Omaru's 135th annual bird show. Geese are the new birds on the block, and the Poultry, Pigeon and Canary Society president says they were welcomed with open wings. So every year in the last 135 years we've held a show, and um, just, yeah, so this year we've got a new addition to the show, it's we've got geese here for the very first time in, in that time, um, and it's quite exciting. The, uh, if you have a look around there later you'll see that a big Chinese goose has won best waterfowl in show so that's a real thrill for the owner of that bird to have it the first time here and to win best bird so pretty exciting for them. Clint O'Brien says geese stepped up to the mark where pigeons were banned in keeping with Poultry Society's guidelines as there's a nasty illness affecting the population. We've got an exotic uh, disease that's come in from Australia in the last six months um, it's a disease uh, that's been in Aussie for about three years. We've been quite wary that it would eventually get here, and it has got here. So um, out of uh, caution and respect to the breeders, we've, as clubs, we've all decided unanimously to not have pigeons this year. 800 birds were entered in the competition, but O'Brien says if pigeons were allowed to enter, it would have put the total number of birds entered over the thousand mark. He says many of the types of fowl represented at the weekend's event have been in New Zealand since colonial times. A lot of these breeds go right back to the early days to the sailing ships and they were brought into New Zealand by the um, early settlers and people have loved them ever since and, um, and are still showing them today and it's really good competition here with some of the breeds. Four geese were entered this year and O'Brien says their appearance was so popular he expects their number to grow year on year. In Omaru, the South Today.